All right, this is Clark Logo here, and I'm waiting to be joined by my co-announcer, Mr. Ron Head, making his way back up from interviewing the SAT with, with Donovan Morgan coming in, and I don't know what, what was Donovan Morgan thinking. Hold on a second here. You're all American woman, the hottest, and I will say not one of the, I'm talking about the hottest independent female wrestler on the scene today. Without a doubt, without a doubt, Ron Head. A mere 23 years old, and I could almost call her a veteran. She's already wrestled in Japan against the top female fighters, Mima Shimoda. She's fought against Yumiko Hata, Mariko Yoshida. And, and Ron, don't even forget, she has made a name for herself here in the United States as well. Well, another lady who's been around this business a little bit longer, and she's going to be coming right down that very ring to not only wrestle, but it's going to be a fight. It's going to be a knockdown, drag out fight because they not only have to battle for that win, they have to battle for the respect of not the fans, not you and me, Flaco Loco, but one another. Yumi Sukai has been in this business for almost one decade, wrestling for that JD promotion. She's fought the top stars in Japan, including legends, Linus and Asuka. here she comes, here she comes, Ron. Over a 15-year black belt in second-degree judo, currently residing in Boston, Massachusetts, under the tutelage of Killer Kowalski, who's trained some of the best, like China, like Hunter Hearst Helmsley, and now it's Yumi Sakai. And Ron, if I'm not mistaken, this is her pro wrestling iron debut, correct? This is the first time Yumi Sakai has stepped into the ropes for pro wrestling iron, and the first time she's ever wrestled Sarah Del Rey, Warren Michaels with the official ring introductions. One hundred and seventy four pounds of twisted steel and pure sex appeal spitting at the fans. Oh, mixed reaction, mixed reaction tonight. How are you gonna like getting spat at by Sarah Del Rey? Hey, I wouldn't mind to tell you the truth, Ron. You are a pervert, you're a damn pervert. Sumi Sakai, definitely the fan favorite here in San Leandro tonight. And Sumi Sakai, with years more experience, has been all around the world many more times than Sarah Del Rey, who's basically just finishing her second year of wrestling, already in her third year, and has made such an impact on the independent ladies wrestling scene that she's had to fight not only the women, but a lot of the men, because the women in this business, especially in the indies, aren't suitable. As the fans solidly getting behind Sumi, Yumi Saka, Sumi she is, Sakai. She's getting under Sarah Del Rey's skin. She's definitely working the fans to her favor, Ron. But Sarah Del Rey oh. is staying focused in the power of Sarah Del Rey. Boy, the power and the beauty, Ron. The power and the beauty. And the fans are already turning on Sarah Del Rey. As the power has to go in Sarah's corner. A waistlift, trying to waistlift takedown on Sarah, but Sarah is just too powerful. Definitely. That lower Definitely. center of gravity and, well, taking maybe a cheap way out and with a rope break. De Sarah and look at definitely that. the stronger of the two in this match. Using a rumper stumper to take Yumi Sakai down. When does Sarah Del Rey develop this attitude? What has she got against Sumi Sakai? You know, I, I would have to blame it on the fans. I would have to blame it on the fans. Look Ron. at this, wanting a test of strength. Maybe a foot taller. Oh, she's playing with her. She's just toying with her, Ron. You know, Ron, I, I blame this turn. Oh, look at Sumi oh, now. Using standing the referee on the referee to So you don't need a showboat for Sarah Del Rey. She's all about business here. I'm blaming it on the fans, Ron. Shoulder, no one budging right there. It's like running into a pink Mac truck again. A beautiful pink Mac truck. Can't argue with me on that one. Sarah Del Rey calling her again. Ducks underneath. 
Beautifully done. Handsprings lands on her feet. Drop toe hold, Sarah, Sarah into the middle ropes. And what would what you would call, call that? that? What would area? We call code? That a 5-3-0. What area code is Tokyo, Japan? A freaking kick to the head and oh, a camel toe clutch she's with got the a hair. Of hair, Ron. Tom Castor not allowing the submission hold because he's pulling the hair. She keeps breaking the hair, pull with one hand and getting another using that referee's count. And that pain has got to be coursing through the body of Sarah Del Rey Flacco. I tell you, these fans obviously have no regard for the rules. I can't believe how these fans have turned on Sarah Del Rey, Ron. Fire persons carried by Sarah Del Rey. Picking her up. Great display of ah, strength. Just dropping her on the top. Turnbuckle. Oh. Did you hear that? And Sumi Sakai felt oh. that. She has to have the wind knocked out of her, Ron. You and cannot wrestle when the wind is literally kicked out of you. And the fans starting no Sumi chance, picking her up and almost driving Sakai through the ring. Lateral that's press. It. Tom Caster, referee, counts two. I, I think that's a slow count, Ron. I think that is a slow count. I can't believe how these fans have turned on Sarah. Sarah would definitely have to be the hometown favorite. But these, well, can't, these fans, they don't care, Ron. They well, a hair mare care. with the rear chin lock, except for perverts like you, Flaco Loco, nobody hey. generally likes getting spit at. Hey, well, if, come on. If, all right, if we were talking Mike Modest, Donovan Morgan spitting on me, then I'd have a problem. Hold on, lateral it's press. Oh, uh, almost a three count. Yeah, you wouldn't want a man spitting on you, but a hot chick's okay. Hey, I'd like to see someone who would disagree with me on that point of view. Now how much would you pay for that? Never mind. Let's this wrestling match is more important. As you, Sumi Sakai powering her way, trying to power her way with a series of back elbows in the midsection. Ducks underneath the clothesline. Tilt to whirl into a head scissor takedown. Sumi Sakai now with more fire, but gets oh, knee to the gut. cut off. More wind is getting knocked out of gut wrench. I'll just call that the old gut wrench salto. Over. And, and it's, it, no. What does Sarah Del Rey have to do to put Sumi Sakai over, Ron? And look at the look in Sarah Del Rey's face, frustrated at her lack of ability to put Sumi Sakai away. Now again, an insulting and painful boot a stomp She's to the back of the head. Her. She is just toying with her now. Oh, look at that. Now again, grabbing her by the hair and oh, using the, the ropes. The seems to be getting in the way. He... Sumi Sakai, maybe her hair tangled in the ropes, which no, by I, the way I, are steel cables. I, I, I think you, you misinterpreted that. Sarah Del Rey was simply helping Sumi Sakai up. Helping her up. The center of the ring, there you go. She wants a, a clean match right in the center of that ring. She well, saw Sumi Sakai tied up in the ropes. He was trying to bring her back to the center of the ring for a good old-fashioned wrestling match. Maybe Flacco no Loco needs another visit to Lance Crafter. Look at Sumi Sakai rolling her up and... Oh, she had a handful of tights, Ron. She had a handful of tights. Quick sliding behind, backslide on Sarah Dow. No! Fast count from the referee. I'm not watching the same match as you. Oh, great backbreaker. Sarah Del Rey. Every oh, bit of it. momentum now. No. Sarah Del Rey still not able to put Sumi Sakai away. I have to say Sumi Sakai with so much guts, so much intestinal fortitude, and has that fighting ability, the endurance. If you want to beat her, you may just have to knock her out or kill her. You know, Ron, what one person sees as guts, another person sees as stupidity. She should have just stayed on the ground, calling it a day, and hit the showers because Sarah Del Rey oh. is definitely toying with her. No, look at this, Sumi Sakai. Oh. Missile dropkick off the ropes. And the fans are solidly behind Sumi Sakai, who's gonna take to the air possibly. Okay, the referee has to start counting here. She's not supposed to be up there. What the? Oh, missile dropkick from the top. That just might no, be no. it. But Sarah Del Rey, Give that lady credit. I tell you, Sarah Del Rey isn't just the toughest female wrestler. She is easily one of the toughest wrestlers in the pro wrestling iron locker room, Ron. Has her hook, but can't oh. pick up almost two, uh, 180 pounds. But look at that! I can't believe it. Powering Sarah Del Rey into a full body slam and putting on her special gear. Come on and play. 
What's this? What's going on, Ron? Sumi Sakai going to be airborne, but misses. Misses that moonsault. Oh, devastating clothesline by Sarah Dewey. And this has got to be Hooks it. both legs and no. What is it going to take to put Sumi Sakai away? Sarah Del Rey so frustrated, picking her up. Vicious power bomb coming up. No, no, Sumi Sakai rolls her up. Two, three. Amazing. Um, no, that no, that was not count. it. Only a two count. Oh, that Devastating time a power, power bomb. bomb. This has One, be it. two. Uh, no. Ron, are you noticing a difference between the referees counting between Sarah Del Rey and Sumi Sakai? Well, I'm referee Tom Caster is getting to involved. Look at Sumi Sakai going back. Now reversal by Sarah Del Rey. Sumi Sakai with a that? quick victory what roll. That? Three, that time that was it. Ron Head, what the hell was that? That was a pinfall. That was a victory. And that was a win for Japanese sensation Sumi Where the Sakai. The what the hell was that, Ron? That was coming from behind. And that is one bitter bitch. Bitchin' lady in Sarah Del Rey. She has every right to be bitter, Ron. She's been cheated. She's had her back turned on by these San Leandro fans. She's the hometown favorite. But the fans have taken a liking to Sumi Sakai and having hissy fits, having a temper tantrum, and maybe PMS it. Sarah Del Rey coming so close, I yet so you, far. Sumi Sakai was lucky today. Was lucky today, Ron, but the next time those two warriors meet, I doubt she will be that lucky. Sarah Del Rey is tough, but there's no substitute for experience. Warren Michaels with the big, black, long, hard microphone. And I'm the dirty one. What are you talking about?